Alright guys, welcome back. I would show you all the failures that I've had on another video of this because that is a that is the fully under equipped first fight but now I'm here again I'm fully equipped I have a level 3 lightning spear and a level 5 phalanx just a base phalanx this was basically what I used the last time I played in the Japanese version to fight against uh, the last boss now what you really want for this guy accessory on by the way you don't want him to be getting a equipment that uh, makes him run too slow or something because uh, survivability is a very important thing here so I'm gonna assume uh, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna try giving him an RPG instead provided he can find one uh, yeah uh, maybe something lighter I guess yeah there we go this one There we go. Okay, give him the Nash on tree that we pick up somewhere. Alright, for this stage itself, Uvo is not exceptional. But of course, the people who are important is one you definitely need a healer. Uh, this time I'm gonna pick, and I always pick Nina regardless of what. So, my last choice on the other hand, I get to choose between Elfride and Uvo. I'll take Elfride instead. Alright, um, you get this if you completed this stage before, but however, I am not using... I completed the stage online while helping another friend. Uh, if you do have friends, please try to complete it together with friends if you cannot take it because this is... You are going to have a lot of troubles fighting this boss alone on your own. But that doesn't mean it's not possible, like I'm going to show you now and how I used to do it. That was my first try back then and I did it in one try so I'm gonna do it in one. Hopefully I will get to do it in one try over here because uh, it's not easy and I even came in prepared because I brought flashbangs. Why you bring flashbangs? You will probably understand later. Oh, Alright, let the game begin. The first thing you wanna do is take out all these shields reason is because these shields can block your Ibarra from going in and you won't be able to stun him the first time you're here. So you have to take it out as soon as possible. There, yeah, there's one down. Nina is being very nice, taking down the other. That's what she always do. That's why I like Nina so much. But Nina doesn't even need you to prompt her to tell her to freaking get rid of everything. Later, you are going to need. Remember to use your commands. You have to use your commands well for this because if you don't, then you are going to have a lot of problems. And of course, the first thing you want to do is start, start throwing chains through. Why? Because you want to be able to take out his boosters as soon as possible. And the best way to do it is by spear throwing. Look at that. Look at that. It's already half broken. Okay, now I hope someone else, Elfride or Nina, throws something for it to come down. In the meantime, let's try to pull this feather down a bit. It is entirely possible and we will smash your face so you understand. I always try to go for the same boosters and make it as fast as possible or your life is actually going to be slightly more difficult. And do try to take note if the boss is in rage mode, meaning it starts doing more damage to you because when it does, you are actually gonna get a shitload of problems and if you do get the tools down for you do it as soon as possible you want the boosters down as soon as possible you don't want him to have too much time to recover and look yeah I don't know how that happened I think someone uh, used uh, to rely on him not because I threw him down and uh, as oh my god no Okay, I suppose I will be using one of this. Okay, let's try to put him down again. The last time I tried, I failed. I think someone barra him instead of cooling. And I have a healing, healing ton behind. Which is great. And okay, now is the time. After this, you need to get them to suppress enemies. 
each enemy personnel. I believe that will help them. They will automatically go for all the chain. If you do that, yes! We have one distance down, we just have to keep going. This is awesome. This is awesome! Alright, now, now, in between this, and that of course you are going to have a lot of problems with oh my god you just killed everyone you have to save them if you don't save them you are going to have problems everyone is going to have problems save and save this guy save the other two oh my god that is dangerous okay try to do long range save don't don't get too close to any of their um, any of the chains is possible like assholes but okay what? That guy just turned around just to keep me. Fuck you. Alright, I do have the re auto rescator Kisator or something. Okay, let's go back for the change. Yes, my stun is back. We are going to try to get it down and we are going to throw another spear at him. Just like that. Yep, down. Alright. More spears going as the most important, but see, I think I get to do one more before he recovers. I try to throw it and anger that it hits the thing multiple times. That's always good. The power of the spear. Something I yeah, very good. I don't know if this can reach, but I'm gonna try it anyway. There's like no reason not to try. And the fields are coming, the fields are coming, run for it, run for it, run for it. Get the guy and then run for it. And take that guy too. Get out of this. Oh, I see a lot of lightning. Save my accessory. Yes. Okay, the power of the spear of this region is still shown here. Why I brought the phalanx by the way is for situations where uh, I can't reach the... Oh my god, I just died. A lot of people just died. Thank you. Thank you, Angrida. You have... Oh. Oh, I revived using the resuscitator. I thought I revived using the... Oh wow, at least I'm still alive. Run for it, run for it, run for it. And try to get this jelly off this guy. How to get rid of spears? You pull them down, you flashbang them, and you sh you beat the shit out of them. Of course. But honestly, it is not going to be easy because that's what they do. They irritate the shit out of you. And why are they all behind me? No, save me, please. Thank you, Angry Da. You are great help. Oh yes. In the meantime, oh he's doing the suck in move and that is the most dangerous move when the chains are around. Oh my fucking god. I am so dead. Oh, I'm alive! Alright, let's try to invent some spear. Try not to go near, try not to go near no matter what. And Oh yeah, you... Oh my goodness. And I just used my revive some more. Alright, there's this first attack here you want to use. If you get a chance to... And then get... Oh my... Oh, this is so angry. This is making me so angry. That's how it is. Oh my god, there is this... There's this healing thing over here. Yes. Okay, what, what we really want to do is we want to be able to kill those guys. In the fastest, shortest time possible because the chains, now that we doubt the boosters, they will die. Alright, I think we can do it again. It's gonna be quite successful. Come on, come on! Okay, guys, down here. His rage mode is longer, no longer active, and the 
the oh my goodness oh can you finish it before you finish the move ah he managed to do it i am going to try oh my god he didn't do it okay let's try again we are going to do our best God, I, I always recommend the sphere so I don't know what I'm doing. Probably because that chains are all over. Oh, let's try to take out this guy. Alright, I hope he doesn't revive anymore. We are going to be bringing down. And I mean, we are going to be bringing down this guy. This guy. Any end to heal me, he will heal me. It will protect me from this guy before I throw the spear. Yes! And there we have it. One more down. The spears are going to get lesser and lesser. I mean the chains are going to get lesser and lesser. But I am also have a very high chance of dying. He is... The boss is going to go into rage mode soon again. And the chains are going to be extremely active. It is the hardest part of this game to be honest. But nothing we can do. Nothing we can do about it. Do. Oh, I should have jumped away. Oh, damn it, everybody's dead. I am going to lose the health here. This sucks, but yeah. Alright, let's wait for a few more guys to come by. But we, we are down to left, like, three chains? For a flashback. And I'm here to. I mean, I'm here to save you. I'm here to save you. I'm here to save you. And no, that was not good. How dare you? Okay, you want, you want to? You can always do that. And we can always put the chain die master. Okay, always do. Okay, now is the time that I'm worried about my health. I start to. Last time I did it. I started running all the way to the back and shooting everything I get my hand to. So prior to that, I will be aiming another of those chains regardless. There we go. It's awesome. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. We are almost done. Come on, this is going to be a successful run like before. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it right. There we go. One more. Damage isn't very high, but it's totally used for cutting, and I'm all the way at this end, so you can't really do anything. Now, if we manage to make it all the way. And here there's only there's no boosters left. And life will be simpler by that then. Because when he starts going crazy then Oh he killed so many people damn it. Oh yeah and try to keep as many of them as alive as possible because if you do that, that means you are uh the chain won't be doing this. Yeah. But, oh man. As I was saying if there were more people alive, you wouldn't have to die. Not always the case. Not always the case. But highly probable you are supposed to survive a lot more than what me. I suppose. Look at oh my god, my death is now. Okay, throw a flashbang so that we can make it safe. Now we have a good chance to throw the spear, throw it, take every spear throw you want with pride. And I did not get hit of course by this kind of thing. Some things just can't be helped. Like seriously. But yeah, I have only one spear left and these boosters are all gone, oh my god. Oh wait, there's one more. Okay, we, are, we have to take that down now. So much for the stand. Alright! I think we are... Oh, someone took it down. It wasn't even me. Oh well, that works. Now 
Point good in space, bro. We are out. Yeah, I'm supposed to stay far away. Alright, now that's no more. I want to clear that down, there's only one more clear left. We want to avoid the light. Oh, come on! Alright, the power of the spear! Alright, alright. Good! This is awesome! Just that he's an asshole and he's like a jump on you. Hi! Let me poke your face. Okay, in the meantime. Yes! Yes, this is why having a healer on is always good, but my accessory is all the way over there. What are you doing there, bro? Okay, we're almost done, and alright, let's finish this off with the most stupid thing ever. Oh no, I feel like Ning. Why, wh oh my god, why am I still doing here? Can someone save me, please? Yes, run for it. <laughs> he didn't get that hit by the lightning. I am impressed. Such skill shown by my accessory. Angry Dad. I mean, Angry Da. I really wanted to call him Angry Dad, but there was a. Woo! There was a word limit to it, so. Yes! Guys, this is how you take out a boss alone. Find a proper sphere, you don't have to be too overpowered, but yes, you have to grind it up, don't be like me. Just grind it halfway and try to kill him with a short sword. That is near impossible unless you have a lot of chance of grabbing onto his boosters. Or rather, whatever that's called. But I hope this is. Well, then again, I, I can't say goodbye yet because. We are going to have a look at um, the ending cutscene. So, alright, so for now, let's just take a look. I hope you guys enjoyed the boss fight as much as I did. Because I always love things that are difficult. Rage inducing, yes. But it's fun. Oh, yes, 14 minutes. Not too fast, not too slow. That's the usual. Alright. Got lots and lots of stuff, and we are going to continue. Seven thousand years down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, Natalia. Everybody just closed the door. What the? Using their bare hands, what? Yes, Beatrice. Fall into my hands. Ow. <laughs> you, you just backstab me. Okay, what do you mean what do you mean? Oh hi Oh look, you're very back What? Why putting on a stack makes him someone from Tengoku? Doesn't really make sense, but okay. Yeah, okay.
I don't know what it is, but okay. It's always cool to look at it again. I've only really seen it once, so it's good to be able to see it. Yeah, you pull me in. Such awesome. time I was here I'm like cool so many abductors really what I think is I, I it would have been really fun if we get to have abductors on our own like have two abductors battling it out but yeah Now we walk through uh, fire, now we walk through ice. But 
Hell yeah, let's go. I want those leggings. Why does it do you have so many belts on your leggings or something? よく来たら人間。お前の持つ夢を歓迎しよう。お前に2つ贈り物を授けよう。チェザレ。かしこまりました。ご親切。1つ目はこれだ。人間の思いを力に変える武器。<笑><笑> まずはこれで、あの姉妹玄関を止めてやれ。もう一つはこれだ。棺の種。ここと地上をつなぐ扉を作ることができる。オッケー。人間。落ち着いたらまた会いに来い。でも、そうだ。その時はもっとゆっく
pull you through the main credits to the cast and I'm gonna stop the video at here after a while because it's been a good 30 minutes and I hope you guys uh, got something to use from my boss fight itself other than that I'm I'm not entirely sure what else you can be doing but I hope you guys enjoy yourself as much as I did I will be coming up with facilities uh, tutorials and all that for sure because now I am fully prepared at I mean I'm at code 8 which means I will have all the resources I need and I will have access to most of the things from now on however I suppose we should mm, let's see um, what do we call it I'm always distracted by this okay. Uh, however, um, you do, you guys do, will need to practically wait even longer because now I'm busy with clearing things out from my room, clearing things out from a bunch of other things to work on, and there's also Evil Within. I really want to complete that before I continue on with other games. There are also a bunch of 3DS games I'm playing, Monster Hunter and such. So, in any case, if you guys want anything, to see anything of course, um, do just let us know here. And I mean, look, wow, I love the OST. Such awesome. Alright guys, enjoy the credits and at end credit stuff as well, so... That's a localizing team. I think that should be. Look at that. This is free. This, this was a pretty long journey, you know, right? I think about it. Got a good 16 hours of gameplay just by doing story alone. There's gonna be a lot more to come. Uh, considering I average around 40 minutes a game in the later stages. Mm -hmm. I definitely played more than whatever I have recorded. And you guys should do. So really really like this game I'll make a review of this game soon as well I suppose I mean, now that everything is finally done I, I've always felt I don't have the right to make a review just by playing half of the game I should consider playing the entire game completed before I can make a review that's something I want to although that also means a lot of reviews are gonna take forever <laughs> to come out but yeah why not That's how things can be done. You guys can take a good look at what's going on. Really, this is, this is awesome. 
And of course I wish I had a proper hit set. I will be getting one I suppose next time. Whew, just look at my room, damn it. My room is almost dying. Trying to die. Ah, they got translators, that's good. I like that. Your translations were not the most awesome stuff, but it was mostly on point, it conveyed the value the thing the characters wanted to say. I'm happy for Matthias. Matthias has stayed in character for most. Uh, of course, I'm, the thing is I a little mm, hope it could have been better was things like changing ten, uh, Tengoku to on high and maybe uh, calling blank them. Uh, that was bad. Um, and some some of the I know I can tell you try your best so that's good really awesome actually considering how much work it that it has to be translated and how many things has to be translated I'm glad it wasn't like what I saw in the demo consider uh, at the game start I don't recommend using demos like that because it gives me a kind of a fear. Uh, what I see in the demo is what I would get in the game. I bought the game anyways, I'm not... I am impressed by what the translation has done. And of course I hope everyone else who bought this game in my country, Singapore, is as impressed as I am. Online play is awesome, provided there's no lag of course. Online co-op play is awesome. Online PV play, uh, PVP player on the other hand, although, although it's creative, it's not just it's just not that good yet. It's pretty cool. We, I will be going in depth on PVP, and I will be constantly playing that. So I hope to see everyone else from other Panopticon work together, play together. So Hong Kong is too strong, by the way. I will complain that Hong Kong is too strong. You have too many people playing it. Uh, what do you guys do? Damn it! You have ten thousand people playing it. I only have, I only have. Um, how many was it? We only have a thousand plus in Singapore. I, I don't even get that. I <laughs> wish we had more to be honest. But, all right. Life's awesome though. So I keep cool to it. Uh. Just let the credits roll. Other guys don't want to see the credits. Please do skip it. I'm just recording for the sake of recording. Oh man, are you serious? Oh what? They just played.
Yes! Here he comes. Now is not the time! Finally, we are at code 8! Hello! Here is the good news. The face is so close! ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、